Hello, my name is Vispianko. In this video we will have a look at a Gerber Made in USA belt sheet. Uh, this is the typical belt sheet that is available in USA for quite a while now. It has the ACU camouflage, uh, which is by now of course outdated. Would be nice to uh, have the same sheet in a multicam and I'm sure they make that too. It's just not yet uh, sold as a bargain or as a deal. Uh, doesn't matter for the appearance too much or for the look. It still looks uh, really nice, classic with that uh, greenish grayish uh, top material. On the back side we have uh, three uh, loops for horizontal carry so you can put the belt basically through here to uh, one of them or all three of them how you want uh, unfortunately not uh, in a setup like you can uh, carry it like this unless you have a, a mole belt or something where you can loop it in uh, so for uh, my own use I'm gonna make me belt loops out of a material of a webbing uh, one of one and a half inch uh, wide webbing that goes through and then simply loop it and uh, stitch it so that is possible too. Now what I want to point out is the build quality of that made in USA by Gerber. A really really nice build. Uh, I say quite likely for the US military so this is not a a trash or a garbage or something is really nice done. Of course we have velcro for uh, the flap. Uh, some prefer that, some prefer a rivet, uh, a snap so that you can snap it on. But it is how it is. But uh, the material is thick, sturdy made, especially on top of the flap there. We have quite a bit of velcro for the closure. It's of course adjustable, you can uh, go even if you are pretty much completely down here, you have still half of the velcro, you can go uh, as high as I would say about halfway on top if you have a bigger, bigger item. And of course those uh, are mainly designed for carrying the multi-tools. But of course other items as long as it has the, the size will fit too. We see here again the ACU camouflage. A typical digital camouflage from a while back. So I had quite some multi-tools that I needed a, a sheet for. And that was now finally the deal of course a non gerber uh, items, I mean uh, non gerbers uh, Gerber tools are uh, gonna gonna fade too. This is just Gerber like like the others, different model, and uh, you see from the fit it could even get a bit bigger, but uh, it works really really well on a, on a couple of of different uh, models. Here we have the smaller shorter model. That works too. You can always, if you have a problem or if it's uh, too pointy like this one, you can always put a bit of material in here from the inside so it would not uh, stab through. That's what I need to do on this, this uh, version because that is simply going to wear through the, the material over time. So I did look around for a deal and finally found that. I did try out. Just a basic generic uh, belt pouch, belt sheet uh, made in China with the uh, favorite chinesium that they use. And uh, price wise, this with shipping and that on sale was pretty much the same, uh, which is amazing. And uh, the quality build of this item is not near where the Gerber made in USA one is. Of course we have a, a nice fancy Chinese home version of a multicam, a US multicam, 
but uh, that's not gonna help if the the bag fails or the the material rip we feel them the, the material is way thin of course we have a, a molar strap and all that with the snap with the shiny shiny part here the velcro is not near as big as by the US version so they did save there too and uh, the only benefit is it's a bit longer so you could actually fit a, a flashlight like this regular uh, 2 CR123 version of the Surefire in it so I'm still gonna use that sheet of course too just not what I did intend it for and uh, yeah that's basically all for for this video uh, we have a lot of choices still on the market so in the current situation if you have uh, a need for something like that have a look at the Gerber made in USA product as they really are really well and great made